Hi, in this problem we're going to show that this function f of x comma y equals e to the x minus y is a solution to this partial differential equation. Let's go ahead and work through it. In order to show that this function is a solution to this differential equation, all we have to do is compute del u del x and del u del y and basically plug them in and show that the result is zero. So let's go ahead and do it. Let's compute del f del x. This is the partial with respect to x. So when we do that, we treat all of the other variables as constants. So in this case, we're treating the y as the constant. And we're going to use the chain rule. So the derivative of e to the x is e to the x. So here we have e to the x minus y. So that will be the derivative of the outside. And then you leave the inside untouched times the derivative of the inside. The derivative of x is one, and the derivative of y is zero because we're computing the partial with respect to x. So again, we take the derivative of the outside, which is simply e to the x minus y, leave the inside untouched, times the derivative of the inside piece, x minus y, the derivative of x is one, the derivative of y is zero. So this is equal to e, to the x minus y. So now we're going to compute del f del y. So same thing, we take the derivative of the outside, we leave the inside untouched, times the derivative of the inside. This time we're treating the x as a constant, its derivative is zero, then the derivative of negative y is simply negative one. Go ahead and put the negative in the front. So this is equal to negative e to the x minus y. Okay, so now we can add these up and show that it's zero. So we have del u del x. Well, actually it's not u, right? It's f, so del f del x plus del f del y. Right, because in, in the problem, in the, in the question, u is uh, what's being used in the partial differential equation, but u is really f. So I'm gonna go ahead and call it f. And del f del x is simply e to the x minus y, plus, and then del f del y we said was negative e to the x minus y. These are opposites and we're adding them, and so we get zero, and so that shows that this function is a solution to this partial differential equation. I hope this has been helpful to someone. Good luck.